Okay, here we go. We're going to start off. This is lesson 20, mini project side scroller. You guys are going to recreate this thing. First thing is draw your background. Easy. Sample game had a simple background of blue sky, white oval cloud, and a brown ground. You can choose to make your background as simple or complicated as you want. Well, let's make it simple. All right, find the comment background. Oop, there it is. Use the drawing tools to draw your background. Run the program. Easy. So I'm going to go to drawing. Beep. Go on down here to, first of all, I can do a background color. It can be any color I want. Let's see. Um, and I can even just type in, I can use one of these ones or I can just type it in. I want it to be purple. That's right. Very crazy. All right. That's good. It's purple. But you need some ground here too. It grounds like a rectangle. <clears throat> so I'm going to grab a rectangle. And I don't want it to be purple, so I need to get a fill. I put it right above the rectangle. The idea is, oh, I'm putting this stuff in the wrong place. Let's go down here. Is that we make a purple background, then we tell the computer to pick up a yellow crayon or whatever color you want, and then it makes a rectangle. Let's see. Okay, that is not does not look like the ground. So the first thing is I need it to be long and skinny. So I'm gonna look at my X coordinate. I want it to be 400 across. And I want it to be, oh wait, time out, no, that's not that. I want it to be, oh, let's see, 400 and 100. Let's see, did that work? Oops, I just like sent it off into the nether regions. All right, time out. Let's bring this back to the middle. All right, so it's right in the middle, 200, 200. The edges, got it. So I want to make the height, hold on, I can look. I want to make the width 400, the whole length. I want to make the height 100. Boop. There it is. Now look, it's way over here. I want this corner to be like down here. So the X is going to be like zero. Let's see how that works. Okay, good. Now I just need to bring the Y down to like down here. I'm going to say to 300. Not point 300. Bam. There we go. I have a background and I have a ground. Now you could put another, you could use ellipse. That's a circle to put a circle in the corner if you want a sun or a cloud. It's pretty easy. If I want a white, but this is fine. You could leave it right here. Or I could say, you know what? I want to put a little white cloud in there. I want it to be white. Just grab an ellipse. And I put it in. Ellipse is circle. Now it does not look like a cloud, so I want to make it. Um, I want to up. But first of all, I'm going to change the shape of it. I'm going to make it maybe 200 wide and maybe 100 pixels height. Oh, that looks like a cloud. Now I can put it right up here in the corner. Let's see, I'll say 30 by 30. I'm looking right below, say like 30 by 30. This is my X coordinate and my UI coordinate. Let's see. Ah, that looks good. Eh, it's kind of off. I'm going to make, I'm going to move this over. I'm going to make it like 70 and 70. My X coordinate and my UI coordinate. All right, and you can add all kinds of other stuff, stars or whatever. I don't care. Um, that's up to you. That's how you do the background. Boom, chakalaka.